Once again, we're uh, doing the election for president in 2016. And I think there's a couple issues right now, what's going on in the country, that uh, people should be aware of, or that actually the candidates should be freaking speaking about. One thing is stomping on the flag. Yeah, it's your freaking right to do so. It's a symbol, but it represents every freaking citizen of the United States of America. So you're stomping on your fucking self. And then I think there's going to be a lot of fucking vets that's going to go to jail for seeing that shit. And I'm one fucking one of them. The shit in fucking Baltimore. Everybody's making it a fucking black-white issue. But it's not. It's a fucking left-right issue. All the goddamn fucking people in Baltimore, the mayor, the DA, the chief of police, uh, half of the blacks that were, half of the cops that were indicted for fucking beating the shit out of that fucking heroin dealer are black. Uh, the city council members, only six people are white out of 23. I mean, how is that uh, racism? I don't fucking get it. Just don't get it. And then the, the looters were pulling people out of the fucking bars and beating the shit out of them. But it just, it's just, I just don't understand that shit. I'm not for that crap. You know? Come, come. Do that shit in Texas. Do that shit in Idaho. You know, do that shit in fucking Arizona. You motherfuckers don't have the fucking balls to do it. Because it shoots your ass. Citizens will shoot your ass. You only do that shit in the liberal fucking states. Where there's fucking big time gun control. Anyways. I like to give kudos to Texas for freaking stopping those terrorists that were going to shoot down the people that were drawing the mo pictures of Muhammad, cartoons of Muhammad. Yeah. Oh, is he disrespectful to the Prophet Muhammad? Oh, yeah, so is... But isn't it your right to do so? Isn't it your right to uh, make fun of Jesus, make fun of Muhammad, make fun of Buddha? We're Americans. It's called... Yeah. Oh, and here's the other thing. Wake up. Yeah, there's nothing in the Constitution that says separation of church and state. But that is only a term to explain that there is separation of church and state, you fucking idiots. Tired of it. Just It just boggles my mind about the, the, the war going on in this country because people are too stupid to actually read. They want to divert deny whatever you know just totally divert the whole thing to make it decept their version of the constitution and this is not right it's plain and simple it's black and white it defends everybody we are equal under the law doesn't mean we're equal doesn't mean we're all the same intelligence we're not we are all equal underneath the law but the main thing that I would like to have the candidates freaking talk about is why do we still trade with countries that do not have any EPA regulations? And that we do go after our country so severe that letting all the businesses go to Mexico, China, India, but they have no EPA regulations, and that's why they're making so much money. But they're killing the environment. Why don't you liberals wake the fuck up? I don't get it. Because I'm all about not cutting down the trees. Hell, if we... You know, there's a lot of reasons, you know, what we need to do is, like, maybe legalize marijuana so we don't cut the down our fucking trees. And then, but that's, that's like a fraction 
of the problem with the environment because of what China and Mexico and India and, and Brazil, all kinds of countries around Russia are doing to kill the environment. But we're being the, oh yeah, we got to do this. No, the whole world's got to do it. Or it's Mox Nix. It doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. But anyways, all that doesn't matter because this is what they're doing in Washington anyways right now. Peace.